Greetings, Art 100. It's time for your new assignment. We are covering now graphic design. Tonight's assignment, logo design. But first, a word from our sponsors. All right, we're back. And here's your assignment. Select a company or organization and redesign their logo. You know how important logos are today. They're everywhere, literally. I can't turn around without seeing a Facebook logo somewhere. Free publicity, that's what I call it. But so what you need to do is choose a company or organization and redesign their logo. Think about creating a new logo. How would you change it? How do you think you could make it better? It can't look like the old logo. You got to find a new angle and play off on that. So what you're going to do is you're going to create six thumbnail drawings. If you don't know what a thumbnail drawing is or a thumbnail sketch, think about your thumbnail. It's not quite that shape, but they're little square sketches um, for bigger ideas. So you're playing around with these um, designs and these little thumbnails. And once you have what you think is the golden design you need to replicate that on a four inch by four inch square so you have six thumbnail drawings you pick your favorite and then draw it on the four by four the last step of course in your design is submit your finished assignment thumbnails and drawings via the journal so make sure you download the assignment and follow the steps and take a look at this project I did for a little company called Buckhorn Children and Family Services. All right, peace out. Here's the original Buckhorn logo that I began working with. So I started, of course, with thumbnail sketches, roughing in some ideas until I find a little nugget that I want to expand on. And I've done that here. I'll change it a little bit, but I have a basic idea. So I create a vector logo, and here's the unveiling of that logo. I have a B representing buckhorn and the sky, and I want to show new life. So I have the sun, the mountains, the tree, a bird, new fresh life in buckhorn. I also created some alternative logos that they can use throughout the season. So this is a new Buckhorn logo. You can do some research on some other great logo designers by looking up these names. All right, talk to you later.